Hola, mis gatitos. ¿Cómo estás? Me llamo Alicia. Hello, my bunnies, my kittens. How are you? My name is Allison, and today we are playing In Between Land. Just so you know, I am so happy to be doing this again. Oh my gosh, you have no idea how much I wanted to record and edit a video for this channel. It was driving me nuts, and finally I did manage to upload at least two videos in the past month. Um, not, not enough for my liking, uh, but that was because of the PR assistant position. And hello guys, that hopefully will be the last time I take the PR assistant position for so Special Olympics Missouri. As much as I love Special Olympics Missouri, that was a really stressful time for both emotionally and mentally. And for some reason, I do not like those kind of challenges when it involves, when it, when it's like a time, time, uh, I don't know how to phrase it. <laughs> and I probably do know what, what you, what words to use. The words are just not coming to my mind right now. <laughs> but, oh my gosh, I am just, I'm so happy to be home and I'm so back to be on my regular schedule. There's still a couple of things that I do have to take care of uh, before the end of August, and hopefully I can get that done. Hopefully I can get that done in the next month and a half, because really I'm supposed to have it done like two weeks after August starts. So hopefully I can get that all done. It is the capstone project for Alps U, uh, which is the university that I helped uh, Brandon Shotsis. Brandon shot sick starts in Special Olympics Missouri. I am so psyched and I'm so glad that I'm going to be completing that degree. All right, if anything looks out of place in this frame shot or anything like that, it is because I'm trying to make sure that the screen capture is perfect. Um, anyway, guys, let's get on to playing the game. Oh my gosh, I missed this so much. <laughs> and let's actually look at the journal just to refresh, or sorry, no pad, to refresh my memory. Um, right, we had to make a concoction to melt something, I believe. The door I'm trying to get through is covered with a thick and disgusting mold. It must have been growing there for a long time, and I swear I actually saw it move. At least it hasn't talked yet. Yeah, creepy. Um, oh, I do remember this. I think I said I wanted to do that in the next video, I believe. And that is probably this video. I can't quite remember. I found an old book that talks about exotic talks <laughs> I'm just kidding about exotic animals and their feeding habits and it has information about jellyfish this room is dominated by a huge aquarium for one very large jellyfish if I could find the right bacteria to feed this lovely creature maybe it would give me some if it's venom what a fascinating idea and this is this this is supposed to be huge very large it doesn't look very large to me. Um, whoever made this game did not do a very good job at making this large. Because that looks pretty average to me. Anywho, um, what are these papers? I believe this is where we have to make something, I think. Or did we already do that? Did we already do that? It's not a good idea. I guess, did we already make it? A uh, lock piece, empty scoop, green crystal. Yes! Okay, so. Um, I believe in the previous video we had been we were able to complete these two. I forgot what they look like. Um, but we do need to find the rest of these, and we have six of these to find. So uh, you're not one of them. Uh, you are one of them. Give me. You're not. You're not. You're not. Give me. Where is it? No. Okay. Eh. No, gimme. Nope, that wasn't it. Gimme. What? 
Eh. No. What the butts? There you are. Um. Give me. You are almost done. Give me. Booyah. Now we just now we just need these, and for some reason they are a little difficult to find, only because we pretty much have everything else. And so I do want to ask, how are you all doing? Were you guys able to manage to survive without me? I imagine so, considering I don't have. Well, I'm not going to bicker about that. Okay, we still have one more to find. Give me. Wait, what? What? Aw, you party pooper. Eh. 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 You, oh, I'm sorry, what? Boink. And I'm a... Oh, that resets it. Are you freaking... Oh, it's because it's missing a thing. Um, okay. Boink. That was it. Where are you, precious little thing? That's a full ang of the There we go. That's a full ang. There we go. That's half. That's a full ang. There's a halfling. Give me another halfling, please. Abuya. What? You know what? I forgot how. Oh wow. Okay. Uh. Halfling. 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 Give me halflings. I just need one more. Yay! Yes. Awesome. And now we can Zabang. Do you have a better idea? Okay. We give you the green. I thank you. Okay, so we need two more empty vials, right? A doing, a doing. All right, but I do know where those go because we saw the images of them over here. This one goes here. This one goes here. And this one goes here. So that means we are missing one. Huh. I wonder where it could be. I'm not gonna do a hint. I still need a shovel. Oh, uh, cause I think that's what I need to put there. What else? Find all the flasks for the chemistry device. Yeah, but I don't know where that last flask is. I can't remember where it is. From the oven and fill it with the sand from the- Oh, I'm dumb. There we go. Okay. We are good. I probably shouldn't have done that hint because it was obvious, but hey. Oh, we are putting this here. Booyah. Oh, this makes the last flask. Got it. Booyah. I haven't finished preparing the chemicals to light the burner yet. Um... 
Oh, what did that say? Where where are the notes? Okay, so we need that one to be filled with green. Right? That one. Got it. So now we can put this back. Fill it with red. Or purple. Whichever one tickles the fancy. And which one needs to be filled with purple? The one over the Bunsen. Got it. Alrighty, so that means the yellow goes in here. Got it. I'm remembering now. Because if you guys aren't familiar with what I said at the beginning of the... At the very, very, very beginning of the game, I have played this game before. It's just been a while since I've actually played it. So I am familiar with most of these puzzles. Uh, Alright, and there we go. So now we can light it. A booyah. Purple goes with green, and then it goes in here, and blah, 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 blah. goes bubble bubble bubble. A sizzle sizzle sizzle, and a purp and an orange and a red, and it goes bump a bump a bump a bump. Ooh, it's turning orange. And now blue going down here, and then up and around, and then ba bam, it's giving me a blue goo. And if I remember correctly, a we use a that's blue goo. Right here. I just destroyed the mold. The metal ring is levitating and rotating. And it looks like we have a puzzle. Um, if I remember correctly, we want all of them lighted up, but we don't want any of the beams touching each other. So, this is kind of like that one puzzle from Nancy Drew, Shadow at the Water's Edge. Uh, where you have to, like, figure out all the... Figure out all the lenses... For the, uh, picture frame. Oh right, we want all of them lit up. I forgot. I've forgotten how to do this specific puzzle. I'm not gonna use the skip. Eh, I should know this one. I mean, technically, I should have it all done right now because, but I can't because I don't know the anglings of everything. So. Actually, you know what? I just realized I don't think I need the actual things inside the... I mean, I do remember this puzzle. I just don't remember... Oh, hello. It's just, I can I can see it. I can get it to this point, but... Ah! It's always down to, like, one thing. Nope, I can't figure it out. I thought I'd figure it out by now, but I can't. Oh my gosh, this is taking forever. I thought I'd figure it out, everyone, but I don't. I can't remember. You know what? Actually, you know what? I think it's this one time where I'm going to cheat. Because normally, I've noticed that I cheat at least once per video. Minimum once. Maximum is probably four. <laughs> so I'm actually going to check and see what I did wrong. Okay, so it turns out this... It's supposed to go here. And this here.
Um, this goes up here somewhere. This here. Finally! Jeez, that took forever. Give me. Ooh, portal. So, oh, I think this is the, these are the last three. Central machine in the main hall open to reveal something. Blah, 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 blah. I will take so that. Happy Thank that you. We found all the crystals. You're a true friend. You've done almost everything. Explore the tunnels behind the door with the circle. Find the island's engine and activate it. When this is done, we'll all be free. You know, when I first played through this, I found that very suspicious. Because that was just too easy, you know? Give me that, please. Thank you. Hi, Rat. Nancy Drew would have squeaked at that saying, Ah! A rat! Referring to Phantom of Venice here. <laughs> Boink! Thank you. Dum, 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 dum. Boink. And here we go. This one actually shouldn't be too hard to do. Wait, do we have a new entry? We do. Wow, the last crystal revealed itself in a such a beautiful way. I arrived in the highest parts of the tower where I encountered a metal circle levitating in the middle of the room. I opened it and saw an amazing sight, the white crystal suspended inside a shimmering whirlwind of energy. I reached in and took the crystal, which caused another portal to open that leads back to the main hall. Now I have all the crystals. Let's hope I'm close to the end of my quest. I placed all crystals inside the mechanism in the main hall, but nothing happened. Instead, Mary's spirits visited me again to tell me that my journey isn't quite over yet. I have one more task to complete. I must restart the engine that powers the island. The engine room can be found inside the tunnels behind the door with the blue circle. Hi, Twinkle. Mm. So if, if I do sound weird at all, it is because... My throat hurts so bad. Well, not so bad, but... It's been... It's had this, like, lump in my throat. I've had this lump in my throat since, like, last Wednesday. And it's been driving me nuts. Uh... What do I... Where do I put this stuff? None of it's, like, giving me a definitive... I can't remember if it locks automatically when it's in the correct spot. Again, I am at a loss. Gus, dang it. It should be simple to see, but for some reason I'm not. I'm probably over time on recording. Oh, geez, yeah. Well, I guess I'm... Excuse me. Considering I've made no progress, guys, I think I'm actually going to go ahead and stop here. Only because I didn't realize how long I've been recording. And two, I need a little bit of a break so that I can uh, relax my throat. As I said, I feel I've had this lump in my throat since last Wednesday or Thursday. I can't seem to get rid of it. So, wish me luck. Uh, send good prayers or whatever to get me help me get better. I love you all. Mwah. 
And uh, since I am back, I don't need to make that spiel about coming about not doing any videos or anything like that. So I hope you all enjoy this video because I know I did. And if so, smash that like button like a kitten would. And if you're just now tuning in to this channel by watching this video, go ahead and hit that red ugly subscribe button. Make it that beautiful gray. And also that bell icon right next to it that'll notify you of all the videos that I do, which are on Tuesdays and Thursdays, rarely Sundays, and uh, Fridays are blogs. I hope you all have a great, have a great morning, afternoon, evening, or night, wherever you are in the world. I am Sweet Rascally Rabbit, saying goodbye. Stay awesome and stay on YouTube! Headache central yet again. Maybe I should go ahead and buy those glasses then. I am on my computer a lot. <laughs>